we want um, I decided to come and do an update video for you guys because you know I haven't been making any videos recently I think the smell for the cereal going back well it expired yesterday but you know sometimes it lasts for like a couple of days I don't think so so I have to run out and get me some bacon egg and cheese on an everything bagel love it and get my fix of breakfast so um, I'm just gonna talk about a few things not much has been going on but I do have some really big interesting news that I think you will find big and interesting all right, so first off, let me hurry up. I'll do a piece of this video now, and probably a piece later, if I remember <laughs> to do it later. Um, so my hair, last time you saw me, my hair was like this, but I twisted the front with just a little bit of gel because I decided not to wash the hair. I've had it in now for three weeks, I think, and I want to push it for two more weeks at least. Uh, but I don't want to wash it because I know if I wash it, it will go, it will like slip out too much for me to twist and or I will have to like redo it in order for it to look kind of presentable but this will suffice for now what do you think I think it's okay yeah also I don't know if you can tell that the ends of my hair let me see if I can make the zoom up and stuff did it I don't know if you can tell the ends of my hair is purple it might come off blue on camera I did dye slash paint my hair <laughs> I will do a video on how I did it and um, I wanted blue next time so I'm gonna do it again I'll show you guys how I did it, it was much brighter than this so it'll be perfect if you're going like a carnival or Halloween type deal you can do it and it's definitely not permanent it's easy to come off it's you know it's, it's really really good so it was way too bright so I kind of like dimmed it down a lot when I say a lot I mean a lot I might post a picture to show you all how it was to how it is now face something's up with my face these days and I can't really pinpoint it because I wasn't wearing makeup all the time and then I put on my covergirl train one foundation if you have not used that foundation try it I think it's a great foundation for somebody who don't use foundation and kind of want to start using foundations that's a good one to start with in my opinion but I always use that foundation and these days when I put it on, my face don't look right. It just doesn't sit properly with my face now. It, it's not working. It's not working at all. I have a darker color, but everybody is saying that the color mocha that I'm using that I thought was light for me makes me dark now and then i have i think spicy brown or something like that which is darker so i can't use that because duh, it's darker so i've been just kind of riding it without makeup i don't know if you can notice i put a little bit of bronzer type thing right here i was always doing my brows i showed you guys this already this is this one sun kiss is it this uh, yeah from um what brand is this again did you do rimmel london it looks like this I usually use mascara but i bought this mascara and i don't like it because one it don't give me the volume it doesn't give me the volume that my great lash gives me I'm looking for a new mascara. This is my Holy Grail mascara, the one with this brush tip at the end. Absolutely love, love, love this mascara, but I'm like, you know what, let me give it a rest and try something else. I should have tried something that's new on the market. And um, 
but this is all I think mega plush volume express mascara is supposed to give me volume because I am good on length when it comes to my lashes I want more volume and <laughs> It doesn't really do that for me and also I noticed I am a big believer in doing your bottom lashes too so I always do my bottom lashes and this brush is just way too big I've been using the other brush the great lash brush for my bottom and this brush for the top it's not a terrible mascara but what I noticed too is during the day that my the mascara runs on my face right here you know what I mean it I don't know like my lashes don't be that long to touch here I mean run all the way down here why I don't know I don't like that at all and people don't tell you when your face have mascara on it for some reason some people think it's rude like when I see people with lipstick on their teeth and stuff like that I'll tell you I'll be like you have a little something on your teeth I don't think that's rude or anything I notice something that's off and you can be better without it there so I always tell people and the people is like oh my god you tell people that like oh my god even my mom was like she don't tell her friend I'm like what kind of friend are you mom and your friend have lipstick on she did you like I wouldn't tell she eventually just come off really no I just tell people because you know it should just tell people man I'm a little mascara yeah I'll be like if somebody tell me that I'll be like oh really damn you know get that together and act like it never happened right so let's talk about my nails I am trying not to get a filling for at least three more weeks. It may not happen because look what's happening already. This. And I buy a little pack of crazy glue. When was it? Day before. And I don't see it anywhere. I swear I just drop it in my drawer. Going back in the drawer, I'm not seeing it anywhere. I need to stick this back. And I did these, this design. It's just dots and um i always do it to hide a um what you call it uh, i always do it to hide a a grown out acrylic and it pretty much lasts like three days or so and it's just fun to do you know you take it off and then you use different colors for the dots next time and it just uh it's a cute look it's a cute look next time i'll take my time and do it a little bit neater because i did it outside and was rushing and stuff like that but um i think it's a really it's cute for the summer especially and in the winter you can do it with darker colors with browns black and white and things like that so I find that was cute. I'm not gonna take it off just yet. Maybe on Wednesday. Today is Monday. And maybe Wednesday I will change the dark colors and see what I can come up with next. And um, yeah, so my birthday is coming up this month. It's my birthday month. Where goes the end? the 28th of august and i'm putting together a like a girl's lime it's supposed to be like maybe six or eight of us <laughs> it should be fun because i never did something like this before it's a um, milestone birthday so i wanted to do something pretty decent it went from here to kind of down here because i was thinking about miami then vegas then local vegas which is um local vegas <laughs> i could never remember um Atlantic City and then it just came to getting manis and petties and going out for dinner which I think is pretty cool um it's a pretty decent little line so I just finished my phone but I just finished doing the invites and stuff like that so I'll send that out in about a week or so early so people can know what's me emailed it to myself the um thing is very cute to edit pictures and stuff like that i use ipc i p i c c y it's a free place where you can go and um edit pictures and stuff like that and put writings on it and things like that and then i save it to my computer and then i email it to myself and then i get it on my phone so this is what it's looking like i hope you could see not 
bad. Not bad. So I'm gonna send that out pretty soon. So I'm looking forward to that milestone baby. I'll be 30 years old. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Alright, so on to the big news. I don't want this video to be too too long. Let me just show you guys. <laughs> So that happened <laughs> I am 18 weeks three days and wow it, I've come really far you guys so I did like a couple of mini vlogs just kind of documenting my process from the time I found out up until three months so I will be posting that it's very deep very raw I show a lot of emotion and um, I just want you guys to see like it wasn't easy and I came so far from how I felt in the beginning till now now I'm happy I'm just you know excited and just looking forward to the, the experience and stuff of motherhood and you know things like that so I will post that and let you guys see just how I'm gonna post that so I'll have a few more vlogs for you guys I'll vlog HD second trimester and third you know keep you guys updated and <laughs> um, you know do different vlogs and stuff like that my cousin is coming from Trinidad in a few weeks too so I'll vlog when she's here and you know different things are supposed to be getting into some stuff this coming month so I'll definitely keep you all updated because I haven't been doing much of it you know any videos so hopefully my life will be a little more interested that you guys will want to see some vlogs from me because you know the hair will be embraced I'm supposed to weave it and I want to record that process for you guys I'm supposed to weave it for my birthday so um, I'll be giving the natural hair a rest for a, f a while thumbs up so I would know to do more and update you guys on my life as it un ravels or unfolds all right so yeah also follow me on instagram for updates and things like that because you know it's easier to just snap a picture edit it and put it up yo i cannot put a picture on instagram without putting a filter i don't care how good the picture look i need to put a filter on that picture that's what they're there for i don't know about all you but i always filter my pictures but anyway Keep up with me on Instagram and keep up with us on Instagram and stuff like that. Alright, so thank you all for watching and I'll see you all very soon.